All right, so we're out here on Fish Trap Lake. We left, what, about 6.30 this morning? 6.30, yep. We're out fishing for walleye. We've been catching a lot of bass, but we have caught a walleye each. Yep. Shane and I have been doing this annual trip for how many years now? Oh, probably about 15 or 20 years. Yeah. Uh, we try to get out at least once a year, do a little walleye fishing. This lake is uh, amazing for, for uh, its diversity of fish. Not only, uh, obviously, the walleye, but the bass, as Brian was saying, panfish, northern, occasional musky. Um, I think we've caught, we've caught all of them. They're pretty close to I, it. Yeah, I don't know if we've ever caught a musky have, together, but yeah, we've caught everything else. Dogfish. Yeah, plenty of, <laughs> yeah, dogfish. <laughs> a nice dogfish. Yeah, yeah. But uh, the lake offers a lot, uh, you know, it, as far as where to go, you can go anywhere uh, and catch fish. Uh, we just happen to be in this location today. We've seen the fish this one a lot just because it's a longer run, but we fished other locations as well. A lot of variety of structure on the lake. Rock piles and sandbars and... Islands. Yeah, sunken islands and yep. weed, weed lines that are places where you wouldn't expect, Correct. but can be really good really good fishing locations. And if it's a little windy, you can always find a bay or, or an island to tuck behind and, and still and still do well. Yeah. yeah, there's always a calm spot, unless it's really bad. It's really <laughs> today we're Lindy rigging with live bait. Live bait of choice today are night crawlers, but we have used leeches as well as shiners, minnows. Artificial bait presentations work just as well. We've, I've caught walleye and other game fish on artificial bait as well. You don't need to necessarily run out and buy one thing. They all seem to work, they all seem to produce different times of the year. Right now we're in the kind of early summer stage and so the fish are around that transition from 12 to 16 feet as the summer goes on. We'll start transitioning out to deeper water into that 15 to 19 foot range for, for, for the walleye. When it comes to panfish, of course, we're going to look for the more shallow locations, anywhere from 10 to 12 feet weed lines um, seem to be the trick on the panfish. If you're in the northerns, any weed line that you can find, which pretty much is the whole shoreline, you will find a good diversity of northern, and of course the bass are in there as well. The bass are everywhere. Everywhere are bass. <laughs> as you can see, I got 18 feet and I'm marking fish out here. So they're they're kind of in that transition right now, moving out to a little bit deeper water as the, as the water temperature warms. It's a nice cool morning this morning though. It is a cool morning, yes. Which is nice. We like the water temperature for the walleye to stay between 60, 65. Yeah, right now I'm reading 71. Yeah, a little warm. So that's why we're starting to transition a little deeper. He's got a nibble. So now I'm giving a little line. See he's pulling. There we go. Yeah, we got a good fish. We got a good fish. I'm going to reel in. Really good fish here, boys. Bump on that, which yeah. tells me it's a walleye. Good sign. He's staying out there too. Oh, there you go. Got a good one here. Yep. Oh. <laughs> it's gonna be a nice one, boys. It's gonna be a real nice one. Fish trap lake walleye right here. Yep. You want to bump him? I'm guessing 22. Oh, maybe you're right. Okay, we'll bump him. We'll bump him. Uh, you're probably right. He is a little longer. What do we got there? 24. 24. <laughs> you really sold yourself short there. Yeah, I did. All right. 24 inch walleye. That's a good one. That was fun to watch. 
I could tell when he hit. And I'm like, oh. That's exactly what we're doing. When you said, and I got to hit right now, I was like, oh, here we go. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> Get the cameras going. <laughs> that was incredible. Pretty good day for us again. Not a bad morning. Yep. I don't know. I don't think we've ever gotten skunked though, have we? Nope. 